Welcome back everybody, I'm Jim from Everyday 3D and today we delve into step 6 of the Flying Bear P905X. Step 6 is attaching the heat bed to our frame. So for that, we will need the four heat bed springs, the four M325 bolts, and four hand nuts. They did give me five, so I do have a spare one, So, and we'll also need the heat bed uh, included here. So let me move this stuff around. Sorry for the wavy stuff here, guys. All right, so and let's get going here. <clears throat> Heat bed on the 905X goes on like so. Goes on like this. I noticed that there is a, an immediate difference between the 902 and the 905 already. <clears throat> and that is um, the bed is now insulated. All right, so we take one of these bolts, push it through, spring. And we're going to we're going to repeat that for all five sides, or all four. Sorry. Bolt. Spring. Through. Actually, you know what? Let's go ahead and put these hand nuts on here. Everything in place. I'm not putting them on very tight, just tight enough to kind of hold them in place so I don't <clears throat> lose what I've started. So <clears throat> bolt, spring, hand nut. Once we get all four on, we are going to make sure all of our hand nuts are put on. Not worried about leveling the bed or anything like that now because we still got a long way to go here. But I do like so far that uh, the heat bed is insulated. You know, the 902 was not. We had to get creative with the cork boards and things like that. All right, give you a quick look here in the heat bed. is installed. You can see the insulation. And again, this is the P905X by Flying Bear. That ends step six.